Hello guys, welcome back. This is your host Jessica Dick with another useful and important video. A couple of questions I need to clarify in this video. The first one is, what is the best university to study civil engineering in the UK? And the second question is, what is the best course to choose uh, for civil engineers in the UK? So make sure you watch till the end. So the question is, what is the best university uh, to choose actually for civil engineers? Uh, so whether you want to go to the higher rank university, the cheap, a low cost university, or you want to go somewhere in the middle. So these are the common sort of yeah, uh, scenarios that you can you can go about. But actually, the answers I'm going to provide you is a bit of a political, so it's not a straightforward answer what you will be looking for unfortunately yeah i can give you the best advice which i've used myself personally as well how did i choose your yeah, university for myself my political answer is actually look at the modules it depends on the course to course actually some of the university that will be really high ranked but uh, it doesn't mean that they are high ranked in all the courses i mean that they're going to offer so they will be high ranked in some of the courses but not all of them so that's one of the uh, one of the subjects is out of the way actually so don't go for the higher rank because if you are choosing some uh, if you're choosing or you you are inclined or lean towards one of the universities make sure you check out what they can offer you especially for your course uh, that is really important generally uh, i would say yeah, if you look at the modules the courses the content they're going to provide you i mean if that suits your bill i mean that's what you're going to look at in in your future here in the uk choose that university it doesn't matter whether that's high rank that's a low rank or whether that's a cheap or really a high cost sort of university so it doesn't matter at all when it comes to finding the job it completely uh, go out of the window actually these all these matters so as long the university that provides you the best content for your future what you are looking for what you are aiming to come here to the uk as long they are providing and facilitate with that sort of content that's all you need to look at so if you've got different university Un university of birmingham manchester london whatever yeah where, where, wherever the university is if you choose their content uh, they may be providing exactly the same degree like i mean for instance if if you're going for the construction project management course or the university will ultimately give you the same degree but if you look at the content there they will be completely different and that's where my answers comes along basically you need to look at the content actually uh, the content might be different some university may provide you only the management side of the course uh, the other may provide you sort of a blended between the technical and management courses as well so that's where i said look at from your future perspective what your interest is what your favorite subject are if they all contents are there for by some of the university go and choose those universities so it doesn't matter whether that's that's a low rank high rank completely uh, uh, out of question that that sort of scenario so make sure choose the university based on your course content so just to add an example actually when i started my studies here in the uk for me there were a few options for myself actually when i started structure engineering msc structure engineering in the uk so i had actually the offer from salford university manchester university and harriet wood universities obviously uh, the manchester university was high ranked in the other yeah salford harriet wood harriet wood was better in in ranking as well uh, salford was really the low sort of rank there at the time and actually i chosen salford universities and the sole reason was when when i look at the content actually all the universities were providing the same msc in structure engineering but when i look at the content by salford university they were really oriented to the design or the technical side of the structure engineering that's where that was of my interest and that's how i've chosen and gone for the salford university rather than the higher ranked or the high cost in fact yeah Salford was the one of the low cost as well at the time so I've chosen that university instead so let's talk about the question number two what is the best course for civil engineers to study in the UK so before I get into the details of yeah what to choose uh, I would just highlight yeah what are the opportunities what are the courses what are the degrees they are available actually the core 
contents here for the especially for the MSc in civil engineering so there are various sort of options available and, and I believe that is the sole reason why the question comes again and again from yourselves what is the best actually to choose I mean especially from uh, job perspective as well so the options could be the core subjects like I mean structure engineering uh, it could be environmental geotechnical engineering highways and transportation and it could be sustainability uh, and obviously the generic like you can go into the MSc in civil engineering uh, the, this is the generic sort of yeah, MSc you can go in that as well so the question generally comes uh, what is the best one to to go for actually to study in the UK and especially from job perspective as well what are the more opportunities available for whether you're going to go into the core or whether you choose the generic sort of msc in civil engineering which one would be the best so obviously my advice or my answers is again is a bit of a political uh, it all depends of your interest actually what you are interested in and where you see yourself in the future as well especially i generally say to those i mean they have a bit of experience back home as well I generally say to those guys and uh, those people actually select the subject they are relevant to your experience so you don't lose actually the experience because you already have those experience so you can benefit yeah you can take advantage of those experience when it comes here basically when you come to the UK when you complete your degree so you can utilize those experience for your benefit so you rather than come after completion of your study rather than going for the graduate which is the fresher jobs you can go slightly higher like engineer level as well so that means you can utilize those experience but in otherwise in other case I mean if you choose something that's completely irrelevant to your experience so you are losing those uh, sort of experience back home and you need to start here from scratch as a graduate I mean if that is the something the course I mean they're completely different for instance I will give you an example I mean if someone has an experience back home as a site engineer I mean four or five years experience he's been working as a site engineer or uh, construction project manager there and he choose something here uh, for instance sustainability or water management sort of course uh, which is going to be a completely different scenario here after completion of your studies because you can't uh, manage or you can't actually uh, utilize those experience what you already go through four or five years experience you can't utilize that in your water management or sustainability part of it that's where I say it's really important when you plan your journey to come to the UK make sure you have the source the whole sort of picture in, in your mind actually where you want to go in the future as well obviously if you want to divert yourself or whatever you already got experience if you want to drive out from that uh, from that sort of field that's that's absolutely fine I mean it's no harm in that uh, in that case you can change your field as well here once you come here completion of your studies so you can go into the relevant relevant jobs which would be completely different than what you had in the previous in the past that's completely fine but as long uh, you are happy with that sort of your yeah, approach that's absolutely fine but what I'm trying to say rather than yeah wasting your time whatever you study whatever you experience you got back home you can utilize them for your benefit if you choose the relevant course here in the UK as well again I said uh, this is uh, actually the political sort of answer uh, it's not a straightforward answer unfortunately what you are looking for but I generally say uh, look at yourself are you good at management and can you go and survive into the management sort of side or are you good at technical sort of aspects whether you can go into the technical the design sort of side analysis uh, like I mean structure engineering that would be benefit to yourself or you go completely different sort of mindset so you can go into the business sort of side and you can go into the, again the management not the construction management we have the project managers as well that can manage the whole project as a whole that sort of mindset if you got or even if you go like a QS or commercial side of your uh, touch with you yourself of your interest you can go in that side so it completely depends on your mindset just assess yourself where you see yourself fit in the future and choose a based on that sort of yeah approach rather than if someone else told you that yeah go for this course because it's more opportunities from opportunities perspective trust me if there's a project going on here in the UK they would need a uh, structure engineers they would need civil engineer they would need a water engineer they would use sustainability engineer whatever you name it they will need 
every engineer on that project so the opportunities are well scattered throughout all the disciplines all it matters is what's important to yourself and choose that course i mean that's where that will take you to really high sort of notes and that's that's generally my my answers here to these sort of questions make sure you choose something so you can go up to the level where you need to be there okay guys that's all i wanted to cover in this video if you haven't subscribed to the channel already make sure you subscribe to the channel to ensure you receive regular such videos thanks for watching